somebody decided to go out last night after he was having a lie down and it's now not back. It's 8.57 in the morning. So there's gonna be fireworks today. Sixty-two point three. Uh, I'm happy with that as I didn't train yesterday either. I obviously relaxed um, and I woke up and I'm still the same. I was walking through icy streams that took my breath. Oh my god. So good. I just got home. Um, Leanne's wasn't very impressed because I stayed out and got drunk. I said sorry to her. It wasn't pretty. So I'm gonna take her out for a nice dinner today, sorry. Yeah, so he's home. <laughs> um, but I'm gonna train in about probably gonna be about 45 minutes. So I really, really want a bagel. So I'm just cooking a bagel in here. Macros will go on the screen. Uh, I'll show you Rocker later. Hey! It's great when he goes and fucks up. <laughs> Just going now to the gym. I'm gonna do my lower session. My legs are dying. My art, my ass on fire. <laughs> oh my life. Ooh. I would just like to say I'm sorry for getting drunk last night and not coming home. Buy me flowers. Every, did you go to Columbia Flower mm -hmm. Market? If you don't know what Columbia Flower Market is, it's the most annoying place in the world on a Sunday. It's where people go who have a lot of time on their hands to walk very slowly and look at flowers. Pink pineapples! Pink pineapples, sunflowers and thistles. Oh, I got them to represent. This is amazing. I got them to represent Lee Banger's personality because she's very prickly, like a thistle, but she's very beautiful, like a sunflower, <laughs> and very different, like a pink. <laughs> <laughs> well done. Well, it's a good save. Different, beautiful, and prickly. prickly. <laughs> a good combination, people. If you're looking for a girl, that tell them that's what you want. Beautiful, prickly. Mm. <laughs> Drunk. No. Blind Going for some nice Sunday dinner, make traditional. Going for some sushi. <laughs> Canary Wolf. Yes. Apparently that's what I was doing 
and that's the pet trying to get down into a bar. Go remember that. <laughs> I have made an astounding discovery. What's that? Since coming off my prep food, the importance of elasticated waistband. Ugh. Ugh. Yeah. Oh. We're just on our way home. Right, yeah. so, I'm going to apologise now because the stuff we're showing you just seemed to be that healthy, fitness orientated. <laughs> he really doesn't. <laughs> he really doesn't. Kind of measuring by eye. Leanne used this today when we were eating fish. Yeah. So because I'm so used to measuring my food, I'm aware of how much I'm having when I um, order meals, etc. So we roughly what it was. So I was able to put it in my fitness pack. When you do start, um, when you do have your food and you start measuring it, you don't have to use it all the time you have to, if you're going out and you're like oh I fancy that or you know that you're gonna have a drink when you go out then just be wary about don't have don't particularly have like those of chip and beers and just don't make some deep fried on your ring so that's yeah, fat carbs <laughs> booze all in one it's like if you really if you really uh, top, so take away just just think about take away tips not take away food <laughs> oh should you go take away no <laughs> <laughs> um, just be cautious just be sensible Oh, good night, and we'll see oh, you yeah. tomorrow. tomorrow. <laughs> Remember this time. <laughs>